And now, here's that little girl you're all waiting to hear, that amazing, alarming, maddening creation of Fanny Bryce's Baby Snooks. <laughs> Snooks, where are you going? No place, Daddy. You're acting very suspiciously. What have you been doing, Snooks? Playing with all the little boys and girls, Daddy. Then what are you doing in the house, rummaging through the silver closet? I'm looking for a spoon. Oh, what do you want with a spoon? I want to look down Tommy Hutchins' throat. You want to look down Tommy Hutchins' throat? Yeah, he swallowed the key. Oh, what key? The key to the trunk. And I need the key, Daddy. Well, what do you want to get into that trunk for? I don't want to get in. Mary wants to get out. <laughs> you locked little Mary Hutchins in the trunk? I didn't mean to lock her in, Daddy. Oh, you didn't, eh? She crept in after Dickie. Dickie and Mary locked in a trunk? Snooks, this is terrible. Why did you do it? So they couldn't tell who locked Nursie in the closet. Oh, Snooks, you're a very naughty child. I don't know what to do with you. Should I go stand in the corner, Daddy? No, come here. Now, Snooks, you've got to learn to be a good girl. Listen, I want to tell you the story of a very, very good man who never harmed anyone, yet through his goodness he conquered the fiercest animals in the whole world. Is it about you, Daddy? No, it's the story of Daniel in the lion's den. Once upon a time, there was a good man named Daniel. Daniel who? Oh, just Daniel. And one day, Daniel was carried away from his home in Jerusalem by a wicked king. What was he carried in? Oh, I don't know. He was just carried away. In an airplane? No. In an automobile? No, he was carried away on a camel. Who? Daniel. Now, the wicked king carried him away. What wicked king? Nebuchadnezzar. Nebuchadnezzar who? Nebuchadnezzar. He carried Daniel into captivity. What, Daniel? The Daniel we're talking about. What are we talking about? <laughs> Snooks, I want you to pay close attention or I'll spank you. Now, Daniel became the king's favorite. And one day, the king said... What king? Nebuchadnezzar! He said to him... Said to who? To Daniel. What did he say to him? That's just what I'm going to tell you. He said to him... Who said to him? The king! The king said to him... Why? For no reason at all. He just said to him, my good man. Who's good man? Listen, Snooks, the king said to Daniel, I like you very much. Hmm? I like you very much. I like you too, Daddy. All right, Snooks, all right. Well, the king wanted him to do something wrong. He wanted him to lie to the people. Yeah, no one in him to lie. No, the wicked king. And when Daniel refused to do anything wrong... He was thrown into a den of fierce lions. Why, they real lions? Why, of course. Real fierce lions. And who do you think threw Daniel to the lions? Huh? Who threw Daniel to the lions? Ah! Well, why are you crying? I didn't do it. I know you didn't. The king threw Daniel to the lions. And although the king expected to see Daniel torn to pieces, he was not. Who was not? Daniel. What Daniel? The good man. What good man? Have you been paying any attention to me at all? Mm-hmm. Well, what have I been telling you? You tell me. All right. There was once a lion called Daniel who took a very good man and threw him at the king. And the king didn't want to do nothing wrong, so he bit the lion. Oh, Mommy. Mommy, quick. Come here. What is it, dear? What happened? I think Daddy jumped out of the window. <laughs> 